Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Oh my god, this game is so good. If you don't have it, I highly recommend you guys go out and buy it because it is not wasted money. This video game has it all. Detail, love, and what's another good word for it? Perfection. It is a, it is, it has its flaws, but let me tell you something. It is, it has more perfect qualities than any game I've ever played before, and it's so much fun to play. So let's just keep her going. John? Good to get on. Good. And you? Got everything we need. Good. I think we need another man. Charles? I'll go get him. Meet us at the wagon when you can. Sure. See you, Arthur. Ain't that dumb. Next time, let the wolves eat all your brains. Then you'll be a genius. <sighs> oh, I don't like how this is gonna turn out. So you're heading to the wagon now? Soon, yeah. Okay. Hey, farther. What you want? Hello, Arthur. Interesting, what's over here? What the hell? How are you? Covered from that business in the hotel? Oh, yeah. So we gonna hit that bank I told you about? We'll see. All right, well, I should be getting on. Sure, Arthur. <laughs> what is up in here? An idea. Let's see if this works. All right, this better work. This better work. Okay, sure. <laughs> Interesting. Hmm. 
Very interesting. Where's my horse at? Come on, girl. At least it ain't your job. Ah, shut up, Arthur. Yeah, your job's starting the fights. You ain't winning them. I can scrap, Arthur. I'm just no good at homework. I can see. Besides, what do you care, Englishman? You've got no time for me. I try to find your work, but then you're off cutting jobs with other folks, and your boy Sean doesn't get a look in. Guess I don't want to get shot, that's all. Yeah, you're a real fucking funny shit, Arthur Morgan, huh? Real fucking funny. Calm down. You better sleep with your eyes open. Yeah, well, you're gonna sleep with your chest open if you ain't careful, boy. <laughs> I love you, Arthur Morgan. I love you. Come on, take a shot. Come on, take your best shot, please. Yeah? Grow up. And let me come on the raid with you. Raid? Don't be playing coy with me, son. It's unbecoming. That bloody train you and him has set up. What you're doing out here, you're going to need guns, you're going to need men. Oh, that. So Marston told you? It ain't a big show. I need calmness. If I take you, I might as well bring Micah along. Now compare me to that oily toward again. You're a dead man. <laughs> Fair enough. Anyway, Arthur, what's your problem with me? In fact, don't tell me. I already know. You are threatened by me. Threatened by you? Yeah, my youthful vigor. It intimidates you. Does it? It's a story as old as the hills. The changing of the guards, the fading of the light. You're toast, old man. Okay. And what are you? I'm the future, in all its glory. Yeah, well, good luck. 
Good luck and shut up. <laughs> I want to get some rest before nightfall. <laughs> Wake up, you lazy sir. What are you doing here, kid? I'm coming, John. On the job. I said you weren't coming. Yeah, well, Arthur says I am. And it's his party, boy, so come on, let's go. <laughs> Me and the big cheeses love it. Can't wait to slit some bastard's throat. You sure about this? No. <laughs> are we ready? Yeah. Train's due through tonight. All right, then. It's on. Go All on. right, let's do this. Gentlemen, let's go earn some money. <laughs> yep. Hey, all the horses untethered? I think so. Good. They should follow on behind us. You find a good spot, Wolfman? Yeah. Follow the trail southwest. There's a spot that's remote, but should still give them enough time to spot the oil wagon. They see this block in the tracks, they'll stop soon enough. Apparently, he picks up a new team of guards at the state line, so... It shouldn't be too much in the way of guns to deal with. See? This is what I mean. I disappear for a couple of weeks and you cut me out of all the action. Just the action that requires a brain. Ha ha ha. Ah, you're a funny feller, John Marston. From my folks, eh? You had your feet up the whole time, playing sick, and fondling that new scar like you're gonna buy a breakfast in the morning. You don't know what you're talking about. Stay close on this. Wouldn't want you getting scratched by a squirrel or something. They're left here, towards Rhodes. So, back to what I was talking about. That could put you out of commission for the rest of the year. Why do you have to speak so much? It's incessant. Cause I've still got some blood in me veins. You old bastards have forgotten how to live. I blame you two for rescuing them. Far too much trouble for what we got out of it. Yeah, takes a whole army of bounty hunters to bring in Sean McGuire. And look at me now, in the gunner sea. <laughs> Back in business, boys. <laughs> you know, my dad always used to say... Not the dad, no, please. No, this oh. again. Fine, damn you three. Sulky, angry, scarface. A right barrel of laughs. <laughs> <laughs> so, we blocked the tracks with the wagon, then jumping. That's the plan. Pretty much. Charles, you deal with the engineer. John, secure the passenger car fast, take charitable donations, and make sure everyone behaves. Little Mr. McGuire. Here's good. Stop the wagon over the tracks. Remember, these are innocent folks. We handle this right, nobody needs to die here. Yeah, yeah. Let's get it on the tracks. Whoa, whoa. Get it up. Yeah. Mr. Marsh. Mr. Smith. Mr. McGuire. Yeah. Get over there. When she slows, order. And you? I'm gonna make sure she slows. Let's do or die with you. <laughs> I like it. Get moving. Here she comes. Oh man, this is so cool. I need to get up there. Finish up here and join us on board. Hey, all right. Get on that train. You bastard. All yours, Captain. We'll go on ahead. Everybody stay calm. 
Taking a look yet? There's probably something in here, Arthur. Was he killed? What? What? <laughs> what is it? You all right? Fill the baggage car. For Christ's sake! You ain't even taking a look yet. There's probably something in here, Arthur. <laughs> Double here. That gives you twice the chance of hitting someone. <laughs> Very funny. Oh. Oh. I'm gonna have a right old lump on me head. At least you ain't got a hole in it. Are those tennis rackets in there? Posh bastard. Arthur, we've got a problem. There's two assholes on horses. How many you say? I just see a pair of them. Uh, in that case, we're fighting. Austin Smith, get ready. You men come out the train now, do you hear? We said you men come out now. There's only two of you, you fools. We got a whole lot less to lose. Why don't the two of you ride away? That way neither of you get killed. Goddamn liberty. Eh? There's a few more to turn enough. Damn, my big mouth. Okay, let's deal with them. We got more coming from the trees there. That's so careful, man. Let's kill him already. Holy shit. 
shit. Come on, come on, come on! the valuables Boys, let's keep right. it rolling. We lost them. Whoa. Fuck. Too close. Whoa. <laughs> that was fun, boys. Real fun. We can see what they call you the professionals in the outfit. Shut <laughs> up. At least we made some money. Hey, what did I get? Gotta be a hundred dollars here. Very nice. You weren't even invited. <laughs> what now? <laughs> we still need a real big take. Enough for us to get out of here. Was that a setup? Law turned up real fast. I don't know. I don't think so. I'm starting to get nervous. Think they followed us from Blackwater? Maybe. They found me already near Horseshoe, but I think this law was just locals. I hope so. I'm gonna head into Valentine, see if I can get something started there. Good idea. Either way, we should all go it alone right now. You know the deal. Don't be followed. Uh, of course not, boss. Yeah. Yeah, yeah! Yeah. Can I even head into Valentine? I don't think I can. Yeah. Uh. 
go. Yeah. <laughs> All right. If I do this right, I believe I can get a free pistol. Just gotta make sure I do it right. Should notice me about to rob this guy. Alright. Listen, I don't greet folks who cover up their identity. Whoa! What the hell's the gun? Let me into that back room of yours, right now. Sir, please. You don't want to get involved with them, I promise you. <laughs> you make them open up, or you're a dead man. Hey, uh, open up. It's me. I uh, brought some food and whiskey for you fellers. Yeah, it's only the duck. Don't try anything funny. Put it on the table. You can see we're in the middle. There's some business here. Looks like a nice little business ah, you yeah. got going back here.
man down. Hands in the air. Shots! Shit. Much of a bounty, it's too high. Okay, Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know what I'm about to do about the bounty so high. Oh my god, it's literally all my money. It's all my money. Was it worth the free pistol? I don't know. Thank you so much for tuning in. Tune in next time for another fantastic episode. This was such a thrill, thrill, thrill ride. Oh my goodness, I'm losing. Can't speak right now. I had a lot of fun. Hopefully you folks just had as much fun as I did. That was a very interesting episode. Thank you so much for tuning in. And like I always say, folks, I'm losing track of it, man. I am out of it right now. Damn. Like I always say, folks, I really do appreciate you folks taking time in your beautiful day. Just sit back and relax. Watch me become the ultimate outlaw because that's what it's all about. 
out outlaws for life, baby. Thank you so much for tuning in, and like I, god damn, I keep repeating myself. Tune in next time for another fantastic experience.